थीम टेन प्लांट्स चैप्टर थर्टीन मोर अबाउट प्लांट्स वी लर्न अबाउट द डिफरेंट काइंड ऑफ प्लांट्स इन क्लास वन देर आर मैनी डिफरेंट काइंड ऑफ प्लांट्स ग्रोइंग अराउंड अस लेट अस रीड अबाउट द पार्ट्स ऑफ अ प्लांट बिलो parts of a plant root it fixes the plant to the soil it takes any in water and nutrient from the soil underline the fixes and learn the spelling of fixes nutrient learn the spelling of nutrients stem stem it gives support to the plant it carries water and food to all other parts of the plant flowers flower the flower forms the fruit leaf leaves differ in shape and size they are generally green in color the food for the plant is prepared inside the leaves in the presence of sunlight air and water underline the presence and learn the spelling of presence of sunlight fruit most fruits contain underline contain seeds a fruit may have one a few or many seeds a mango has only one seed apples and oranges have a few seeds papaya and watermelons have many seeds seed parts of a plant the seed contains a baby plant inside it which grows into a new plant when it gets the right amount of air water sunlight and good soil plants store their extra food in parts like stems and roots we eat some of these stems and roots as vegetables potato ginger and onion are common underground stems that we eat we also eat roots of plants like carrot and beetroot think and answer skills explanation and expression pile soaked a few moon the seeds in water she then kept the seeds in the fridge why did her seeds not grow give answer in your own words plants on land plants growing on land are of different types trees are big plants they have a single woody stem called a trunk neem mango and banyan are examples of trees 
this is neem tree this is mango tree and this is banyan tree shrubs are generally smaller than trees they have many thin woody stems near the ground so they appear like a bush rose hibiscus and cotton plants are examples of shrubs this is a rose plant this is hibiscus plant and this is the cotton plant Herbs are generally smaller than shrubs. They have a single non-woody stem. Mint, coriander and spinach are examples of herbs. Climbers have weak stems and need the support of other plants. walls and sticks for climbing grape wine bean and bitter gourd are examples of climbers creepers have weak stems and grow along the ground watermelon and strawberry are examples of creepers plants in water some plants grow in seas ponds and lakes lotus water lily water chestnut hyacinth and duckweed are some common water plants uses of plants learn the spelling of hyacinth duckweed plants are useful to us in many ways they keep the air clean and fresh we get fruits and vegetables from them plants are also used to make many useful things such as oil medicines cloth perfumes tires etc which we use every day food grains food grains are the edible seeds of some plants food grains of plants such as rice wheat maize and barley are eaten as cereals food grains of plants such as kidney bean chickpea urad and moong are eaten as pulses wheat and rice are cereals chickpeas kidney beans and moong are pulses this is the picture of spinach grape wine and watermelon spices spices are the dried roots fruits or seeds of some plants they add flavor to our food cardamom cloves black pepper are spices tea coffee and sugar any drink other than water is called a beverage tea and coffee are examples of beverage we get tea from tea leaves and coffee from coffee beans we get sugar from the juice of the sugar cane stem sugar cane sugar 
fibers plants such as cotton and jute give us fibers cotton fibers are used to make cotton clothes jute fibers are used to make bags mats and ropes this is jute bags this is jute rope medicines plants such as garlic ginger tulsi and neem are used to make medicines garlic ginger are medicines wood trees such as teak and oak give us wood wood is used to make doors windows and furniture it is also used to light fire for heating and cooking skills discussion and expression discuss do you have things made of wood in your home how do they look and feel it is also used to light fire for heating and cooking door wood chair things made from wood other things we get from plants other important things that we get from plants are listed below the pulp of trees such as bamboo and pine is used to make paper the sap thick liquid obtained from the rubber tree is used to make rubber rubber is used to make erasers tires pipes and balloons this is the bamboo tree and these papers made from bamboo this is the tree of rubber and this tire made from rubber the sap that we get from the acacia tree is used to make gum this gum is used to make glue flowers of plants such as jasmine rose and lily are used to make perfumes oils from the seeds of some plants are used to make soap shampoo and toothpaste did you know the venus fly trap is a plant that eats small insects caring for plants if we look at the many ways in which plants help us we will see that plants are very important for us plants are our friends just as we care for our friends we should also care for plants we should water them regularly we should not pluck their flowers and leaves and stop others also from doing so we should help to make the world a clean and green place skills expression and explanation suggest ways by which we can take good care of plants green point skill concern for justice and equality we can help our family in looking after potted plants 
in our home have you ever taken part in tree planting activities in your school or neighborhood take part in one such activity and share your experience in class values and life skills you can use water left in your water bottles to water the plants in your home or school garden choose a plant and look after it have you ever plucked flowers or fruits from the plants in your school or neighborhood garden points to remember this is the flow chart of plants plants parts of a plant root stem leaf flower fruit and seed types of plants trees shrubs herbs climbers and creepers uses of plants food grains fruits and vegetables spices tea and coffee and medicines words to learn nutrients substances that are needed for healthy growth trees big tall plants with a trunk branches and leaves shrubs small plants with woody stems herbs means small plants with soft stems climbers means climbing plants creepers means plants with weak stems that grow along the ground perfume a liquid with a nice smell that you put on your body pulp soft and wet wood used to make paper sap the liquid in a plant or tree that carries food to all its parts glue a thick liquid that you use for sticking things together